Hello and welcome to Mead Week. I'm Brian Spann. With the impending arrival of Hurricane Irene, we've had to change things up a little bit this week. Much of this week's planned newscast featured events coming up this weekend. We suspect many decisions will be made today regarding the status of scheduled events. Even as we're taping this, Maryland has already declared a state of emergency. Ocean City is being evacuated with residents trying to get out by a 5 o'clock Friday deadline. Strong winds, hail, a possible storm surge are expected to hit the state late Saturday night into Sunday morning. By now, many of you are already making your own preparations. Here's a short list of helpful links. The best or most comprehensive site with links to virtually every emergency management subject that comes up is Homeland Security's FEMA website. You can get info on planning and preparation. Links from the FEMA website are connected to ready.gov as well. You also might want to bookmark the BGE website and stay abreast of power outages and the number to call in case your power goes out. Of course, if you haven't done so already, join our Facebook community where you can get the latest word on the impact of the storm right here at Fort Meade. Finally, the Fort Meade homepage will release official information as we receive it. In all of the heightened tension surrounding the arrival of Hurricane Irene, it's almost been forgotten that the week started out with the rarest of natural events in this part of the country, an earthquake, 5.8 on the Richter scale. Centered near Charlottesville, Virginia, the earthquake was felt as far north as Canada. Here at Fort Meade, folks evacuated office buildings and schools. Here's video of Pershing Hill students being evacuated Tuesday afternoon. The building yep. safely down the stairs, exit right. out through the front door. Come on Come on this way. Thank you very much. We also managed to catch up with a dis employee who gave us her reaction. Five seconds of my life. <laughs> screaming, a lot of screaming and yelling. But we all made it out safe, so thank God. Hope that doesn't happen again. In closing, we encourage everyone to gather as much information as possible and make the appropriate preparations. Once again, Maryland has declared a state of emergency with Hurricane Irene expected to hit the state late Saturday night, early Sunday morning. Until next time, I'm Brian Spann. For everyone at Mead TV and the Fort Meade Public Affairs Office, have a safe weekend and a great Mead week.